Dal 2014 sono stato coinvolto in un progetto di ricerca finalizzato da INAIL e Istituto Italiano di Tecnologia per la trasformazione di una mano robotica in una protesi. All'età di 16 anni ho subito un infortunio sul lavoro e in questo infortunio ho perso la mano destra. In questi anni ho avuto l'opportunità di utilizzare le protesi 3 digitali, però non aveva quelle caratteristiche che mi riportavano a una mano naturale. Io cercavo di fare tutto il possibile con la mano sinistra. Hermes is born out of a collaboration between the Istituto Italiano di Tecnologia of Genova and the Center of Prosthetics INAIL di Budrio. It's a new concept of a polyarticulated and myoelectric prosthetic hand with the capability to restore over 90% of functionality to persons with upper limb amputations. Le caratteristiche principali di questa mano sono la morbidezza e la capacità di adattarsi alla forma degli oggetti che voglio afferrare. The prosthetic hand Hannes has been designed so that the compliance and quality of movement are as close as possible to a natural hand and that the user perceives the hand not like an external element but like a part of themselves. The fingers can bend and position in a natural manner even at rest. In particular the thumb can assume three different positions in order to replicate an ample variety of grips from a fine grip that allows one to pick up small objects of small dimensions to the lateral grip which allows grasping of thin objects and finally a grip capable of grasping and even moving heavy loads. Con l'avvento di questa mano poliarticolata è cambiato qualcosa in me. Non più dar priorità alla mano sinistra, ma una condivisione delle attività fra la mano sinistra e la mano destra, come se avessi due mani naturali. The mechanism at the basis of the movements of the fingers, of the force and type of grip, depends on a differential system that confers the peculiar ability to grasp objects by adapting to their shape and to resist any eventual external force in order to attain an optimum configuration that imitates natural movements. The wrist inflection extension is capable of bending and can be locked in five different positions in addition to the active prosupination movements. Questo si avvicina tantissimo a una mano naturale. Combinata al polso mobile ho la movimentazione della falange e in me ha cambiato tutto un modo di pensare. The IIT Inail hand also allows for the rotation of the wrist, which permits moving the palm of the hand in both directions. The multiple movements depend on a control system that exploits the contraction of muscles of the residual part of the limb. The message that is sent from the brain, which causes contraction of the muscle, is measured by two myoelectric sensors on the surface, which are positioned on the inside of the socket of the prosthesis in such a way to maximize the contact with zones of muscle activity. The electronic component of the prosthetic hand has the task of interpreting the muscular signal and activating the desired movement of the wrist or hand. The true intelligence of Hannes lies in the mechanical part which is completely unique in its market sector and gives this polyarticulated prosthesis the versatility and movement of a natural hand, which together with the material properties of the glove defines the characteristics of the prosthesis developed by IIT and Inail. 
through a specially developed software, it's possible via a Bluetooth connection to customize the operating parameters of the hand, such as the precision and speed of movements, to ensure the most optimized experience for each individual user. A seconda delle attività che svolgo, posso utilizzare guanti diversi che mi permettono una presa migliore a seconda degli oggetti che voglio afferrare. Hannes has obtained CE certification as a class 1 medical device. Made in two sizes, Hannes is also available with gloves for both men and women. Con queste mano mi sono riappropriato di una parte della mia vita che mi era venuta a mancare a causa dell'infortunio.